have a moment to say thank you to Chief uh, for this and to the committee, I guess, that made the selections. Um, but I really appreciate this. It's, it's an honor. But I, I, I still think I'm in the wrong place. You know, I don't know about you, but when I got the call from Anita, it was like, uh, is this real? Um, is this true? Uh, and then you think, she's playing me a joke. There's something going on here. And even now I think, um, I, I shouldn't be here. Someone's gonna walk up here and pinch me and say, Virginia, can you set aside for the real living legends <laughs> over here? But I really appreciate this. Um, the one thing I wanted to mention is that for, for all of what we do in, for our tribe, we have to leave a foundation because we stand on the foundation of the people that came before us. And now we need to make that foundation for the people that come behind us. Um, I think the only thing that I, not the only thing, but the, the best thing that I can think of for my tribe that I've accomplished, that I am truly, truly grateful that it's a, a gonna go on, I hope forever, is the challenge goal. I remember this dream that I had. Um, I was invited to witness um, the Cherokee Challenge Bowl. I was on the, the chair of the National Johnson O'Malley Association, and they wanted me to come, and so I went. And um, I was working for Creek Nation. And when I got there, all these kids came running up to me and talking in Cherokee, because they thought I blended in. And, um, there they were, speaking their language, knowing their culture, testing. And I cried all the way back from Tahlequah to, to Oak Monkey. And I thought, why aren't we doing this here? And I, I totally believe that all of us take it for granted for what we have. We take it for granted that it will always be there. But if we don't make sure that it's there, it's going to go away. And the challenge bowl came from that dream. And uh, trying to get people together, I thought uh, Litter Gouch, Tuban Gouch, Wilbur Gouch was the one that helped me. And he says, yes, I will help you. I'll be right there. We got it all together. And it was the challenge bowl that is my legacy for the tribe. I encourage all of you to make a difference with this tribe. If you see something wrong, then change it. Don't complain about it. And I think that's the worst thing we do. We talk to each other, we complain, this isn't right. Well then do, get up and do something. Do it for your tribe, for your children. Look at, look at all the little children that are here. They come up, that, that's who I do it for, is those children. And I want to make sure that we stand upon the foundation of those and make it worthy of what they fought to get us where we are right now. You think about it, the, all the hardships, I always think about the trail of tears. I always think about, I have one member of my family that we know where the grave is, that we marked it as our, our legacy from the trail of tears. It was her that we got here, and I thought if they can suffer, if they can do it, and they got us where we are right now, we need to keep going forward. Don't take it for granted. You know, we have all of this offered to us. We now have this language program. You gotta learn something. You know, we have all these different things that are offered through our tribe. They're wonderful things. You need to stop complaining, as all tribal members do, and start helping. And call somebody. If you see something good that happened, call them up and just say thank you. Call them. I, I want to thank you for what you've done. I thank you. How many? How much money did we give away this year? You know, we we had taken care of our elders, taking care of our youth. We did everything. How many of you thank the tribe? Got up and got a phone call, or sent a card. Thank your tribe. No complaint. If you see a complaint, do it. Step out and do it. Because if you don't, we're going to fall behind. You know, being a legend doesn't mean that 
we're above anybody. It's like we're trying to set the foundation. I know everyone here of the legends that are here, and they have set a foundation for us together. You need to follow it. Mary, Mary over here, she is not foundation for my culture. For, for all the cultures that we have, I learned from Mary. We share each other. From Gary, from Gary that we have here, I've known this man a long time, believe me, way back <laughs> Anchorage. We were in Anchorage together. I was in Anchorage for 18 years. He was there. I told him a story this morning that I remembered how he was so honored by the elders there. I, I know all of all of us that are Betty, I just talked to Betty and we had a connection and we're going to meet each other uh, to be together and to, and to uh, Chief Floyd and um, there's all these things. I honor these people. I stand upon all of their shoulders. I want to thank you. Please heed my words and do something for our tribe and for the young people that are here. Ask them to do better and make better so that we can survive as a tribe. I thank you all. Thank <laughs> you.